Today we're going to visit an apiary and sample some meat. That's going to be interesting because I'm not much of a beer drinker or ale drinker. I'm more of a wine and whiskey girl. And I've never had meat before. But I'm gonna, we're going to give it a shot. What began as a wedding gift of 10 hives in 1888 has become the oldest beekeeping farm or apiary in Texas. Florence and Zachariah Weaver kept bees as a hobby. It was their son, Roy, who turned that wedding gift into the family business. In 1994, the Weavers began selectively breeding for disease-resistant, mite-tolerant colonies. This has allowed Bee Weaver to be chemical-free since 2000. Every Friday and Saturday from February to December, weather permitting, they offer a free demonstration at 11 a.m. Visitors can learn the basics of bee biology and hive hierarchy from some of the most experienced beekeepers in the country. Of course, when you make a lot of honey, you have to figure out what to do with the stuff you don't eat. As it turns out, mead and honey go together like wine and grapes. Wildflower Meadery's tasting room opened on February 15, 2020, the day before filming. Dean doesn't like mead, so I drank his share of the apple pie mead. So delicious. At 25 proof, it packed the same punch as a glass of wine. So friends, if you find yourself on Highway 6 between Houston and College Station some Saturday afternoon looking for something to do, go ahead and give Bee Weaver and Wildflyer Meadery a try. And while you're here, go ahead and click that like button if you like the video. It really helps the channel out. And if you did enjoy this video, hit that subscribe button. We release new videos every Sunday at 10 a.m.